Well, uh, another great ride from this gentleman next to me, Robbie Frad, uh, who bring home a uh, Yankee captain who fought on Gamely, another one, and, uh, to, to, to win a, a very good race. I thought it was a very, very good win from this horse because the second horse, he's a nice horse. Um, and I think it took everything in the horse's ability to run the other horse down. But look, he's a nice horse. He's going to go up, up. He's on the up, same as Lee Star. Both the horses that try so hard and try their heart out. And um, I'm so happy for the stable and for the owners, um, for Sudesh and Joubert. And um, it's just great to get a horse like this to win again because I think he's going to be a nice horse in the future. So it uh, looks like he didn't have the, the best of uh, start today. Uh, you, you didn't want to, to, to be caught wide, so you, you ease a little bit to be back on the, on a offside position, and he, and he fought on Gamli, yeah? He did. You look, you know what, even though we've drawn three, it doesn't mean you're going to be on the fence, because um, those two inside horses, if they jump well as, as well as you, you're going to be stuck there. So I just went back, and I was quite happy, because he's a horse who runs better in that position. He finishes off better. If you have him too handy or too close to the speed, I don't think he'll finish off that good. So. Look, he's going to go 1,500 eventually, maybe even 1,600 this horse, um, the way he's relaxing in his races and the way he finishes off. So, yeah, it was, it was a big effort by him. Um, probably a, hesitated a little bit in the straight, but and then once he got going in the last 50 metres, he really got going and, and dug down deep, and um, he got up to win where, where it matters at, at the winning post. And you were confident on the line? Yeah, I was. I knew I had him half ahead. Um, you know, it was uh, 20 metres before that. It, I was starting to worry, but... <laughs> But then again, he, you know, he fought on well and put his head down at the li on the line, which was good, and very happy for the stable and everybody. So, Robbie, uh, it doesn't matter. And the seventh one look uh, uh, a good chance also on, on the card. Are you fancy this horse this afternoon? I do. You know what? He's as well as he was last, last time when he won. He, he won a good race with me. He beat Dark Force. Dark Force I've won on before, and um, he's a decent little horse. So it all depends on the speed of the race. If they go quick, it's better for me because he'll finish off. And there's no, no other way to ride him. You've got to ride him midfield, relax, switched off, and then he finishes off good. Um, and I'm hoping he, he does the same as last time. So we're crossing and maybe we'll see you afterwards. Yes, please cross fingers, and I hope so. It'll be nice for the stable, yeah. Well done, thank you, Robbie. Thank you so much. Bravo. Donc voilà les impressions de Robbie Frad hein, qui mène à bon port Yankee Captain dans cette cinquième épreuve où il a à sortir le, le grand jeu mais sur la ligne il nous le dit. Hein, il était confiant qu'il avait fait la, la différence sur son compagnon d'écurie Lee Star qui s'est battu comme un lion aujourd'hui. Sur ce on va bien sûr retrouver Jug et Rajiv. C'est à vous messieurs.